Hey guys, back from the store. I was watching some videos today. Some of yours I commented on. Uh, some of them I just liked, but um, I was like, I gotta go get some cards. It's been, you know, it's been a little while, and I've ever really been wanting to try one of these blaster boxes of these heritage cards. So I thought, you know what, why not? So I went and picked all this up. While I was at Target, they had these stickers that were on the front of these for one free pack of baseball cards, but didn't specify what kind. It, it, but it had to be, it, it said it had to be 2018 Series 1 Tops cards, but it didn't specify whether it was one of those small little packs or the big ones. So I thought, well, I'll try one of these and see what happens. And guess what? It was free. So there was a $5 pack of free baseball cards. So not bad. So I'll do these in two videos. Um, going to open the backs on these and then I'll come back and I'll just lay them out just like this. And we'll go through them. I got this one because I had the checklist on the front. I, I want to get all those. And this one had Nick Castillo's on the front. Not real sure he's on the other ones. But anyways, I'll do these first in the first video. And then the second video, I'll do this. So be right back. All right, guys. They're all open. Just as quick as I said, I'll be back. They're open. So here we go. I did see something on the side of this one. So I'm going to do it last. Um, or maybe I'll just mix it up, keep you guys uh, interest, interested. So we'll start over here with the Greg Holland stack here first. I didn't go through any of these, I just saw the edge of that one. So here we go, I'm trying to get around that glare. And Alex, if I get the Matt Carpenter card, it's yours. I know it's the one left that you need. So I will gladly just meet you somewhere and you can pick him up. Kendrick Morales, I didn't know he was in the Blue Jays. Boar, Brad Peacock, Dustin Pedroia, Mitch Haniger, Tom, jo Tom Joseph, looks like this guy's trying to jump ship here. Who is that? Lonnie Chisinau. Got a rookie card. Still haven't got the, uh, well, there's the judge last year. That would have been the card everybody's chasing, but I haven't got the Otani yet in the set, so. Maybe we'll finally get lucky and get them. I, I do like the feel of these cards. Nice, nice thick stock cards. They, they don't have that gloss on them. I feel like if you just even rub them against one another, they're going to scratch. So I, I really like them. They're nice old fashioned durable looking cards. I think this is the 69 tops look. Carlos Beltran, how about that? Pina and JD Martinez. I'm telling you guys, this guy's gonna put up some numbers this year. I mean, look at his home runs. Uh, third row from the right. Can you imagine what he's gonna do when he's on the short porch in Boston? Yeah, if he's protected and they can't pitch around him, he's gonna be hitting them hard. So, all right, Nick Castillos. That's the reason why I bought this one. I didn't know he was in this uh, series. And I don't know if there's any short prints in here. I'm not really looking for them. I just know that they're usually a... Uh... Speak of the devil, look what just showed up, Alex. Setting that one aside for you. Matt Davison. Ken Gillis. Alex, I'll Facebook you so you can... Uh, we can connect on that so you don't have to worry about going through the whole channel. For the rest of you that are interested in uh, possibly trading cards someday, just... Uh, Hit me up on the Facebook page, it's in the description, you know, it's just not a bunch of crazy stuff. It, it's for this channel. Verlander, very happy to have that. Not sure if I got that earlier or not, but Jack LeBrandley Jr. That's got a different display in the bat. Pretty cool. I don't know what the number sequence are in the short prints, but that's probably not one that's still opposed. Short prints, I believe, are actually them in action or playing the game baseball. So Mr. Trout. Ray Mancini. Here's to see what kind of numbers this guy puts up this year, too. As is Mr. Justin Upton, J. Up. No longer a Tiger. I know you guys are probably getting tired of me saying that. That's Clevenger. What do we got here? RBI leaders. That was Korea. And Jonathan Shoup. All right, that's that pack, that's pack number two. So as you can see, this one doesn't have anything in it, but this one has something in it because there's a space in there. So kind of curious to see what that is. All right, so we got the checklist 
or I'm, getting, I'm assuming it's Chris Bryant on the front. So numbers is card 107, so it'd be on this side. 107, just as checklist, didn't specify. I'm pretty sure it's Chris Bryant. If it's not, you guys can correct me in the comments. Need the Otani card. Got the Carpenter, Alex, but I don't have the Otani yet. Cody Bellinger. You guys can get him along with that judge. Sabathia, I cannot believe this guy's still playing. I mean, he's been around. Look how many years he's been around. 2001. And the thing is, is he's been good. Look at those ERA numbers on the right. And it's like one over five. And another one's close, but anyways. Brandon McCarthy. Kershaw. I know you say his name is it, is it Taiwan maybe? I don't know. You guys can spell that out for me in the comments. Pronunciation. I think matter. This guy last year was really getting hot. Um, one of those younger players for Detroit and he was starting to get kind of hot there. I mean 12 home runs. Not bad. But the Tigers. Kept hearing his name repeatedly on the MLB baseball notifications again on my phone. I was like, man, that guy is going well. So I don't know if he's still with him or not. I haven't heard anything from him this year. All right, and there's the last card in that one. All right, so let's get down to business here. Let's see what this card is. It's down here. I'm kind of curious. So, all right. I didn't know I got the pack with him on it because I thought I already had the card. And I, I did look at the first player on all these to see who was in them. So I hope I didn't just get a whole bunch of them in a row. They're the same already as the ones I already have because I've been noticing that in some of the packs. But I doubt it because there's a rookie thing in there and I haven't got very many of those. Well, Myers. Chris Russian. Rusin, maybe? Nones. Is that Grinky? I wonder what his numbers have been lately. Yeah, he's still doing all right. He's, I mean, he was hot when he was with Kansas City, though. And then there's the card. So, I guess they're doing that retro photo look. And it's probably Goldsmith, I'm assuming that yeah, is. I get, he's like Francisco Lindor to me. I get him every time. And I believe that's a printed on autograph, not an actual autograph. So, not really sure how many of these are in the set. Oh, 30. Duh. So, kind of cool. Something a little different than in a, than in parallel. It's to have those edges and whatnot. Not hard to get. Got all these sliding back in. Okay. Eighteen. So they got three rookie stars on uh, that Cubbies one. Cameron Maven. He's played for Detroit as well. He was a uh, kind of dangerous player. He was a great defensive outfielder. Um, he had some decent bat base speed, and uh, he could pop the ball over the fence fairly easily. So, just an all around uh, decent player. Not a lot of home runs there, though. He was, but he was there last year with the Astros. And Jose Quintana. So, I didn't get the um, Otani card on that, but I did get these. Plus that judge card, which was way back here somewhere. But anyways, um, that's what I got for this round. I think I'm going to go ahead and collect the set since I have so many of these. And um, I'll do a separate video with this one of these two because it's getting super long. Alright, thanks.